using word processing software to design instructions. Hi, I'm Bill Carmody. Let me show you why using word processing software to design instructions is so important. The first is it makes it easy for you to create, edit, and save print documents. So when you're looking at the ways in which you're actually going to be using your design instructions, you're gonna to wanna to have the flexibility of making edits and changes along the way. It also helps you with collaboration of those edits and changes we'll talk about in a minute. Copying, pasting, moving, deleting text within a document is so much more easier with word processing software. So as you're writing and instructing, you can also make, make changes along the way and it'll make it easy for you to continue to do that. Formatting text, such as the font type, bolding, underlying, italicizing, means that when you're doing design instructions, you can elevate the most important points. So a big headline to help people understand this is important, let's pay attention to it. Bolding a specific point within a headline or within a particular copy block. Underlying italicizing, helping to make sure that you're illustrating the points that are most important to your design instructions. And then creating and editing tables. So once you've actually looked at here are the steps of a particular design instruction, the tables help you understand things like troubleshooting guides or how do you actually support somebody who's going through this, doing the work and having trouble with it. All those tables will say, here are common mistakes people make and here's what you do about them. Here are challenges people come up with. Here's the solution to those challenges. And then inserting elements from other software such as illustrations or photographs will also help with the visualization of the design instructions. All this can be e seamlessly done in the same word processing software. Of course, correcting spelling and grammar errors are so important. The word processing software typically comes with that embedded. So even as you're writing, you'll see the red squiggly line indicating that there might be a, a spelling error for you to check it out. Or grammatical errors, it'll challenge the ways you're saying things in case it doesn't make sense. And they'll say, is there a better way to say it? And lastly, reviewing and approving before publishing. I can't tell you how important it is once you've actually designed a document to make sure somebody else is reading it. Does this make sense to our audience? And so if it's all electronic, it's all been done this way, it's easy to share it out. It's able to track changes. If you wanted somebody to do some editing, there's an opportunity for them to track all the changes that they want to make. You can review them as the, as the writer or the editor, and you can accept or reject those changes. It makes it so much easier for you to produce these instructions.